Hey y'all, Skywarrior here. I really all hope you enjoy my content. Give a like, comment, subscribe, and enjoy the video. Hey all, Skywarrior here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do the Cincinnati Bengals 2024 schedule prediction. So with that being said, let's go ahead and go over that. Uh, for the 2024 season. Just to let you know that uh, Mars Vince has not been signed yet, but I do have confidence the Bengals will be able to uh, get him signed eventually. Um, if you're wondering what that noise is, it's the fan. And I think someone's mowing their grass outside. So, Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, okay, week one, home against New England. I'm not worried about them. Go ahead and give me the dominating win. Uh, week two, Kansas City at KC. You know, the Chiefs necessarily don't play great early in the year either. Give me the Bengals. I, I like the Bengals. I like our chances of getting that week two win. Monday Night Football against Washington. I know Jaden Daniels is a rookie quarterback, but do not get me fooled, fellas. I watched the dude in college. The dude's unbelievable. This is going to be a good game. But when it comes down to it, I like Cincinnati to get the win. Week four at Carolina. Yeah, they're going to be better. There's no doubt about that. But I think the Bengals take care of business. You know, I think they're going to take care of the Panthers. Here's a tough one. Home week five against the Ravens. Oh, my gosh. I said that we have to split with the division to have a realistic chance of winning the North. So I know it's a tough game. I know. But I think the Bengals are going to take care of this one at home, week five. And who who put this as a primetime game? Monday Night Football at the Giants. Not worried about them. We're going to absolutely smack them. Go ahead and give me the win. So with the Bengals start 6-0 and the first time in a while at week seven. I said split with the North. So, And considering the Bengals get smacked every year they play on the road in Cleveland. I mean, it's happened the last two years on Monday Night Football and Week 1 against the Browns. Uh, so, unfortunately, the Bengals are going to take their first loss of the season. They're going to lose against Cleveland on the road. It, it's just the AFC North is a freaking juggernaut, and winning in Cleveland is something I don't see. All right, coming home against a very tough matchup, 425 against the Philadelphia Eagles. I understand Philadelphia is a tough team, but I think the Bengals – can take care of business against the Eagles here, and they will. Okay. Another home game against the Vegas Raiders. Give me the Bengals. I think the Bengals can take care of business against Vegas. Uh, I wouldn't say quite easily, but, you know, um, I think the Bengals can really handle the Raiders, so I give them a win there. At the Ravens, give the Ravens here. I mean, the Bengals just, they're going to split the AFC North. It's just the way I see it unfortunately. But you got a much easier road game this time. At the LA Chargers, gave me the Bengals. The Chargers don't have a lot of great receivers, even though Jim Harbaugh is a proven NFL head coach at college. It's his first year with the LA Chargers. I'm not sweating it. Give me the Bengals in that one. So the Bengals with two losses. I like her chances right now. Bye week. All right, a very tough home game against Pittsburgh. Give me Cincinnati on this one. I, 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 it's home. I, I like your chances. I know we were slept last year, but give me the Bengals in this one. I, I like your chances in this one. This is a now this next game. This is this is a game saying this is no doubt the, a game that the Bengals will lose. And you know what? I don't see it. I don't think Dallas. I know Dallas is good, but I think they're overrated. Give me the Bengals in this one. Give me the Bengals to win in Dallas on Monday Night Football. Yes, I'm predicting a Bengals victory in Dallas, and I may be going to that game. So if I do, uh, I think the Bengals can take care of Dallas. So at Tennessee, Tennessee's tough. I understand they're they're extremely tough, but with no Derrick Henry, um, I think the Bengals handle business here. I, I think they're going to get the win in Tennessee. Home against Cleveland. Give me the win against Cincinnati. You know how we're doing. Splitting with the North right now. The Bengals with only two losses against two division rivals. And uh, we got two weeks to predict here. So let's go ahead and move on down.
All right, two more games to go home against Denver. Not worried about them at all. Give me the win against Denver. And then finally, the Bengals already have the AFC North pretty much, you know, locked up. So give me – so the Steelers, they're, they're going to beat the Bengals because the Bengals have nothing left to play for. So as of – so as is that, everyone, I am predicting the Cincinnati Bengals – to go 14-3, and three, number one seed in the AFC, splitting with the AFC North. I, usually I'd say the Bengals would probably beat Pittsburgh and Pittsburgh the last game of the year, but this is a game the Bengals don't need to worry about. They already have the number one seed locked up, rest their starters, and move on to the playoffs. So that's Cincinnati Bengals' uh, schedule prediction. If you liked the video, give a like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video. Scott Warren signing out. Goodbye, all. God bless.